എനിക്ക് Sanctuary was never meant for humankind. It was forged as a refuge from the war between the high heavens and the burning hells. Instead, it became a new battleground in this eternal conflict. A secretive group called the Haradrim has kept mortals safe. But now this once powerful order is a husk of what it was and Sanctuary's ancient creators have returned to claim the hearts of humankind. This is the story of their downfall.
better shelter before I freeze. Another abandoned town. Demons everywhere. Fangs in the dark. Gah! He bit me! Careful! He's a wild one. What's it to you? Oswen, hush! I'm sorry, Wanderer. You've come at a difficult time. This madman just stumbled into town and started causing trouble. Demons spilling from the ruins. Kill us all. Kill us all. Ruins? What is he talking about? Come, I'll explain. There is evil staring in the ruins to the north. That poor monk back there must have gone inside. Even a holy man like him was driven mad by whatever he saw. I'm sorry, it's a bit cramped. Still better than a cave. Alenta went a bit deaf last winter. You might need to speak up around her. Oh, nothing special about our little town, but it's home. We'll do what we can for him. Might have to keep him in the shed for now, though. He tried to bite off Osman's fingers. Could you protect us from whatever is out there? We have nowhere else to turn. The evil stirring in those ruins is an affront against nature. I will make things right. Truly? Oh, thank you. Fire's looking good. But I should touch it a little longer. To make sure it doesn't go out. If Devmir's taking up all the space by the fire, just give him a shove. <laughs> What's that? Y you say something? I have remedies if you're injured. Brought these down from Kiovashat. Roads blocked. Should go up when the storm is passed.
The old ruins are clear. Your town should be safe now. Truly? Ha! Huh. By the light, you are heaven sent! Oh, I'm so sorry. We, we haven't any coin to offer. But we have hot stew, good company, and... Stay for a pint. Wash out the taste of the stew. <laughs> <laughs> We'd be honored if you'd join us. To our savior! <laughs> <laughs> Ugh. <sighs> 
mother's blood, my mother's body. So uh, shall you witness her glory before you die. <laughs> drugged me after I returned from the ruins. Just like you. I came to my wits and escaped. Tried to get inside the chapel, but it was logged and... <coughs> what manner of evil is this? Petals? Of blood? They... They must have fed them to me. A blasphemous ritual. How did they learn this? Perhaps the answer lies in the chapel. They kept it locked up for a reason. The key might be on that woman who was leading them. Shameful. Our father has granted you a path to salvation. <laughs> and yet you stray from it at every opportunity. You drink and gamble. You covet and steal. Shameful. Sin. 
Is their birth right? <gasps> My children. The lords of hell are coming to devour our world. Salvation lies not in the light, but in you. The faith has taught you to deny your heart's desire and turned you into a prisoner within yourself. Break the chains and discover who you were meant to be. Break the chains and be beautiful in sin. your child into this world. the light. You collapsed inside. I thought the darkness had swallowed you. I dragged you here and put this cursed place to the torch. What happened to you in there? I saw a vision. A horned demon. She said the lords of hell are coming. She wanted to help the people survive. Help them? She called them her children. And they welcomed her like... a mother. Mother? No. It cannot be. I must report to the cathedral. Listen, there is a hermit to the northeast. A man of questionable loyalty. But he knows of the Forbidden. He might be useful to us. Bring him to the Cathedral in Kyovashad, and you will be in the Light's favor. Looking for the town priest. He stopped sending tithes, and I came to find out why. As I neared the village, I sensed darkness around the ruins. I went to investigate, Found the priest's body. Demons. Foolishly, I took shelter in Nevesk and ate their food. You know the rest. Do not call her that. It is a demon, Lilith. The Gospel says that she will walk among the people, posing as the mother of sanctuary. If she is here... It is humankind's own sin that has brought her. He surrounds himself with dark knowledge. Tread carefully, and pray he has not fallen to Lilith as well.
Salutations, one. Come and don the mantle of history's champion. Let us consider the cards once more. Is anyone here? Young, freshly turned, an easy kill, further south than the others. They're spreading.
trespass into my home. Rifle through my fingers. Then at least have the decency to join me for supper. I'm bloody hungry. That's quite the story. I wish it wasn't true, but it is. Why did I have that vision? Thank those friendly villagers. They gave you the blood of Lilith. The blood of a demon? Not just any demon. The daughter of hatred. The mother of sanctuary. She was banished ages ago. But this world is her creation. <sighs> it was prophesied she would come back. What does she want? That's the question. Sanctuary has always been trapped amid the eternal conflict. A war between angels and demons. But Lilith serves neither side. She has her own plans for us. And me? Am I corrupted? Not sure yet. But you two share a connection. What will you do about it? Use it. Find out what she's after. Good. Then we're in this together. Rest while you can. Then we'll start in Kiovashad. If we can't stop Lilith, we'll all be damned.
without you. Angel in Arius. I'm sure you've heard the Cathedral of Light babbling about their Holy Father. Well, he's real. An angel walks among us. And when he learns that Lilith is here, blood will flow. They are ancient enemies. They'll drag the whole damn world into their feud unless we can stop it. Let's not linger. Kiovashad lies just ahead. Hold. To enter the city, you must We first... have no time for this. <sighs> to enter Kiovashad, you must perform a cleansing ritual. Meaningless gesture, but some people take comfort in it. How dare you! Just let him through, lad. I've tried for years to get Lorath to do the ritual. Fine. But this one stays. I'll meet you inside. Take a piece of holy cedar wood from the shrine and inscribe it with the sin which troubles you. Then cast it into the brazier. As the fire burns the wood, so too will the light burn away your sin. This is a waste of time. Did you say something? Good. You must feel as though a great weight has been lifted from you. Welcome to Kyovasha. A man that old has lived through some dark days. Explains why he's so cross. So, what did you write on a little piece of wood? I bet you didn't write anything at all. I'm off to the dry steps in search of that pale man from your vision. I must know what part he plays in all this. But first, I need you to retrieve something of mine while I finish my negotiations. 
A merchant in the centre of the city has it. Just tell him I sent you. Sacrificing. Summoning demons. Honing all the wonderful gifts that Lilith gave them. The cathedral loves to go on about him. His imprisonment in hell, his valiant escape, his glorious return here, the world he created. But they never mention how being tortured in hell for a few millennia turned you into an ass. There was a prophecy, yes. It foretold the rise of the primevals, the return of Lilith and Inarius, the doom of our world. Inarius adopted the prophecy for his own selfish purposes, put it in the Cathedral of Light's gospel, and made it seem like he would be the hero to save us. Cracked hooves, sway back, cloudy eyes. This poor thing is practically crow bait. With what you're paying. Found a new boil on my hand that that makes seventeen so far. I cannot salvage that. Anything breaks, the forge is hot. So the old man's finally decided to buy it back. Knowing him, he didn't mention coin, did he? <laughs> if he wants his weapon, you will need to pay. Wait. The old man sold me this too. He said he didn't need it anymore, but... I think he'd want it back all the same. No judge. Find somewhere else to get warm. I was here first. Apologies. He also gave me this amulet. What is it? The mark of the Haradrim. An ancient order of scholars and mages. Sworn to protect sanctuary from demons. These days, we are few in number. There is another Haradrim. Donna. His breadth of knowledge about demons is equal only to his hubris. Sounds like he could help us. Hmm. You should seek him out in Skosglan. But don't forget about the Cathedral. They'll be expecting you, and they might prove to be useful allies too. You're not coming with me? I'm going to the Dry Steps to find out who that pale man is. Join me when you can, just... be careful. Your ties to Lilith, the visions you see. You are the key to finding her and stopping whatever she has planned. Sometimes our paths in life are set to collide. We just don't know it. Whether it is by accident or fate's hand, there is nothing we can do about it. The wanderer lost in the storm fed the blood of Lilith, saved by a lone monk. Different lives and incidents drawn together. By what? 
destiny? Or some greater power pulling the strings? I did not know. But at the time, I thought I had the chance to protect humanity from the daughter of hatred. The Wanderer's connection to her gave me hope. <laughs> Imagine that. Downright sinful, the price you're asking. Just last week, I paid half that for carrots. Purr! You keep this up. We'll either be broke or starving by the next moon. Downright sinful, the price you're asking. Just last week, I paid half that for carrots. You see those fools up at the cathedral? <laughs> <laughs> Groveling, crying like dogs. <laughs> yes, well, Bozan has yet to return from delivering our tithing demands to Menistad. Perhaps you could sweep the roads and see what's taking him so long. The cathedral must receive its dues. Hatred demands blood.
Indeed I am. My guard turned on me, tried to choke the life out of me. All I could do before I lost consciousness was go over the cliff. I need to return to Kuyovashad and request a night escort. Please, take the tithing demands to the merchant lord, Talgun, in Menestad. Many fine pieces, rare and beautiful. I am so very grateful. I will need to make the necessary arrangements. Please, excuse me. How did this happen? I shouldn't be holding this in my hands. It should be. Restraint, my lord. in the darkness of the forest before I reached down. Glowing eyes. I've never been so terrified. Something for the cold and dark. Anything breaks, the forge is hot. What will it be? You can take what's left. Bad enough I have to stand watch. Now I'm supposed to police the pickpockets? An arrangement I made went awry, and I was extorted by the ruffian Laskus for protection. He's camped somewhere near the pass to the northwest. Return the gemstones he stole, and I'll make it worth your while. These pilgrims making their way to Kiovashad are good people. We do our best to keep them safe from the vampire infestation, but we can't save them all. Is someone there? 
your help. I can't see. sent you, that spineless merchant. Ha! This will cost him dearly. So, the deed is done. Excellent. I knew you would prove worthy of my trust. I'm sure you've heard the new word as it spreads. We will no longer suffer at the hands of the lesser. Our strength, our might, our destiny is to triumph over the weak.
I'm out of spirits.
I must wait a moment.
What will it be? I tell you, my neighbor is bewitched by some skulking outside my door, muttering curses. Right, right. This wouldn't have anything to do with the money you owe him, would it? Damn cold, isn't it? But at least we are safe. Beyond these walls, darkness reigns. The new militia recruits have been training night and day. They deserve a little praise. But I can't let them see me as soft. Mind giving them a cheer for me? Easy coin for you, a boost of confidence for the recruits, and I get to go on being the hard ass. Everybody wins. I will take care of it. Impressive. Thanks. I hope they don't get used to it. Inarius, bless the child that grows in my belly. Keep him safe in your light. Oh, glorious father, thank you. Your light has cleansed the disease from my flesh. I am made whole in your radiance. My brother told me you have to shield your eyes in the father's presence, or his light will make you blind. That's why the knights wear helmets. We were born in sin. Children of darkness. But the Father's light can be sought through penitence and faith. Walk in the light. We must be ever vigilant against sin, brother. Yes, Reverend Mother. Let the light of Inarius burn away wickedness. Let not temptation lead you from his holy radiance. Let righteousness sear away corruption and sin. Cast out thy darkness, for only light must remain. Cast out thine darkness, for only light must remain. Is this the one from Nevest? Yes, Reverend Mother. Did Lorath not accompany you? He sent me on without him. Putting faith in that old man was a mistake. What could possibly be of greater import? Lilith. So, you know. Hmm. 
We have received word from one of our knights of a demon sighting in Gale Valley. The description matches too closely to the sighting in Neves. If you would travel to Yelesna and take stock of events there, you would have the gratitude of the Cathedral of Light. I had thought to send Lorath, but... Again, he fails in his duty. With or without Lorath, the will of Inarius shall be done. Here, take the knight's report before you go. Reverend Mother, I received a report of a potential demon sighting. Horned woman near Yelesna Mines. Performed routine inspection, nothing yet. Sent in priest and escort of knights. We'll report in when we find something. His skill is unmatched. But as you can see, he's not so reliable. It's not out of indifference. He went off searching for a pale man who accompanied Lilith. So someone is helping her. <sighs> How easily the souls of men sink to darkness. She is spawn of a prime evil. Mark my words, Neves was but the beginning. She will kill again. But our father... The angel Inarius is prophesied to defeat her. Where there is faith, there need not be fear. One of our flock, the watch commander, Vigo, sent word of a demon sighting. A girl claimed to see a horned woman. The risk is too great to dismiss. Seek him out. He should be well into his search. I know what you are. I know what you are. Yosef told me. He told me about Nevesk, about the blood, about your vision. You think you were saved. Pff, fool. A demon's blood is alive. It will eat you from within until all that remains is her. Go to Nevesk. Go! You will see the truth there. I can take gold and turn it special. Well, you certainly have the look of someone who spends a lot of time in the wilds. I expect you'll also want some of my elixirs, but let's focus on your healing potion for now. 
I have some extra materials we can use this time. If you want to improve your healing potion further, or craft any elixirs, you'll need to source your own ingredients. I'll not leave these walls. Never again. No witchcraft here, only honest magics.
Not ready yet. Wait a moment.
Wait a minute. Ready yet.
ready yet. I must wait a moment. Life amongst the fallen, week four. I dedicated this week of my research to the making of fallen demons' weapons. I summoned a fine specimen, the shaman Maliak, to guide me through the process. It showed me with enthusiasm how they drain, skin, and dress their victims' bodies. From human heads they fashion their shamanic staves, which hone their power to breathe new life into slain comrades. I must wait a minute.
I cannot carry any more. My bags are full. Velvet. Need something for it? Keep it. I'm not after your money, just your ear. I can feel it. A great calamity is about to unfold in the northern reaches. The door is in danger. I do not understand. It was sealed for a reason. And now the pig-headed beasts are trying to force it open. Heed my warning and stop them. It must remain sealed. Perhaps a better question is, why are you the only one to take it seriously? I once... <sighs> that was long ago, I suppose.
resist the scent of blood, even their own. I have enough here to lure out a few. Care to join the hunt? Troubles. Good luck to you. The beast lives within you. Greetings.
goodbye. Other loggers being dragged away into the night. We follow the blood and limbs back here. I can hear the screams of the unlucky ones still alive. I can't leave them. But I doubt I'll make it out of these woods. Tell me.
I must wait a moment. Not much, but I hope it helps.
I must wait a moment. Separated. My friends are done. 
I won't last on my own. I can't take any more. I'm not ready for this. Without you, I'd be dead.
burden is too great. Come back if you need work. Ah, I see you have an eye for quality. <laughs> You'll find no finer gem cutter in all of Sanctuary. Bring me your unhewn stones and I will perform miracles. You will see. You're here. My boy, I... Ah, good. You look capable. I could use an extra set of hands exorcising the demon that has seized this man's son. Meet me in the cellar there. And prepare yourself. You're about to witness a miracle. Down here than out there. A sure sign of demonic presence. Take my chalice and place it in front of the boy. I need to read through my prayer book for the right passages. She can be eager in their reading of the scriptures. That won't happen here. Oh, praise be. <sighs> Father Inarius, as I shed my wicked blood, let it be purified in thy light. Let the light feel the darkness. Pathetic. This child. Belongs to me. Angels above! My son! Let the light push out the darkness, hiding within this child. Father, force this demon out! <laughs> Your mewling has no power here. <laughs> I will know for you. His son is mine! 
Father, protect this child with your grace. I command you to flee this body! No! No! no. Slay it quickly before it finds another host. It is done. Mata, my boy, can you hear me? Please say something. <sighs> Father? Where am I? My boy! Oh, father! You're all right. Thank you, sister. You're welcome. I'm sure I will see you at the next service, yes, Peter? Right in the front pew? Of course, sister, of course! Let us give them a moment. Speak to me outside. You did well. You are more suited to this work than you think. There are many more people in Kyovoshad who are in need of me. If you have the time, I would welcome your assistance. They were those girls of yours. Finally ran off to play night, have they? They left for Corvalar this morning. They'll have food, training, more than I can give them. What will it be?
I must wait a moment.
must wait a moment. Wait a moment.
I'm low on spirit. <laughs> Just wait. ready yet.
ready yet.
must wait a moment.
What is this? Get out of my house! What have you 
Another lamb for the sacrifice.
must wait a minute. I need more spirits.
not ready yet. Wait a minute.
must wait to But I'll help. Yeah, that's for you.
must wait a moment. Breaks. The forge is hot. An axe! Specifically the axe of the woodsman. A man who stalked and butchered travelers in this area. Rumor has it, the woodsman disappeared recently and left his weapon behind. The priest who hired me didn't offer much more to go on. At this rate, I'll freeze before I find the damn thing. 
Do you help me find the axe? I'll cut you in on the pay. Check the woods around town. I'm staying here where it's safe. I don't. Perrin does. He's a priest of sorts, but... What he wants with it, I don't know. I've done work for him in the past. Always odd items or objects with a history. He pays well for them. with me. If you do not look, you will not see. Search for a ritual blade or the demon's blood, something of the faithless, something you can touch. Who are you, pet? I am Vosharko. I am Kyovashad. I have lived here for 50 years. I was once the angel's most favored priest. And now, dung slick newcomers don't even know my name! It is not important, it is a vile shithole. But to you, to you it is a place of birth. Ah, you will see. You see, you see how the petal pulses as it touches your skin. You are solid, just as I said. The demon burrows into your soul. A terrible fate, but perhaps Vosjalko will help you. An exorcism. This is what you need. Go to Mercy's Reach. Search the crypts. You will find a holy relic, the child's call, touched by the angel himself. I will require this to purge the blood. The false pilgrims. They flock to the angel's presence once, but he asks patience of them, and how do they respond? They spit at his feet. Those of us who stayed true, we were starved, hounded, forced to leave behind what was most precious. So it was with the child's call. Important. I led the faith flow through the church's darkest days. I was his voice. But Rava, light shone upon her. She changed all this. Her voice burned with holy fire, while mine could not. In time, I was simply another priest, as was good and right.
I must wait a moment.
That's Frost Gloom. I could use it in a little project for one of my best clients. What that client ordered isn't useful to you, but I'll trade you something useful for the Frost Bloom. You have good timing, friend. Quera here is convinced her husband is possessed by a demon. He is! Been disappearing all hours, coming home with bloody hands. He says he does not remember, but he was scaring me. So I tied him up in the cellar until I could get help. And help you shall have. Come, show us where he is. Manifesting already? I don't see her husband. What was that? Upstairs. He ran out there. Quick, before he hurt someone else. Are you all right? It looks worse than it is. I will live. Go! Ivo, look at me. Stay with me. Ah, a demon! A blood soaked horror! Damn, he's gone into the sewers!
He's close. There. Careful. This situation is delicate. Like before, take my chalice and place it down as near him as you can. I'll keep his attention. Vasek, just stay calm. Will you stay the litanies with me? No! No! Stay away! Everything is going to be all right. Father Inarius, as I shed my wicked blood, let it be purified in thy light. Stop! Please! It hurts! Let the light fill the darkness. No! No! Something's wrong. Vasek! <laughs> <laughs> So sorry. We need to get out of here. Fine. It's nothing a one fire and rest can't cure. Thank you. As badly as things went, they would have been much worse without you. Somehow, I must find the words to talk Vera about our husband. Take care of yourself, child. You there? Yes, you. Come now, don't be shy. I need your help. The damned fanatic Thea stole my eyes. She wears them around her neck. And what horrid suffering I've witnessed. Please, no more. There's so much blood, I can't. You, you must believe me. I can still see from them. Thea and her flock have grown strong in Nostrava. Please, bring me back my eyes. Thea. <laughs> she was nobody a few years ago. Disappeared for a bit. Came back with friends, blathering on and on about the end of days. She's a liar. But she's also cunning. She snatched up my eyes, after all. Thea stole them. Pinned them on some necklace she wears, but... takes it with her everywhere. Makes me watch. I wonder if my suffering aids her. I... I can see through those eyes just as you can see me now. What I see is painful. So much pain. So much death. I want my damned eyes back. <laughs> it 
was only an apple I stole. The father wouldn't want me to go hungry, would he?
Wait a moment. Wait on
let me in. I can see that. How oh, pitiful I look. Just give me my eyes back, won't you? Can I just push them right back in their sockets? Just like... That pain! The sockets burn! Oh, God! Mutual friend needs your help, but we must be cautious. Here, she wanted me to give you this letter. Dear friend, I do not know how much longer my shaking hand will hold a quill, so I shall be brief. I believe the demon we thought we slew in the sewers was able to escape death by using me as its next host. Please. Come to me in Kvera's cellar if you can. You're the only one I can trust to help. My life is in. Anything breaks, the forge is hot. Keep walking before I. Oh, oh, it's you. Thank goodness. The sister is in the cellar. Come quickly. And. Thank you for trying to save my poor Vasek. I know you tried your best. The Cathedral of Light used to perform these kinds of rituals whenever anyone was in need. But it seems that lately they would rather burn the demon along with the victim. I still believe in the Father and his Holy Grace. But I couldn't let that happen to the sister. Not after she saved my boy. No matter what happens to me. Since she collapsed in my arms while telling me what happened... ...to my Vosik... I was going to find a night penitent to help her, but she pleaded with me not to. Asked me to hide her and tell any other priests that came looking that I had not seen her. Truth be told, I had to wrestle with that. Lying to the cathedral? Came close to turning her in more than once. But then I remembered that when I needed help, she did not ask any questions. She was just there. Ready to do whatever she could. Well, she deserves the same. Uh, uh, I knew... You would... Don't have... Much time. You need to... Perform... Blood rites. Uh. Exorcise! Demon! What? Uh, I cannot! You need my prayer book, but... Chalice is lost! Need to... Get... New one! Where? Margrave... Matve... He is Chalice Keeper! Be wary... He is suspicious. You may need to deceive. Please. 
Harry. 